like that. Obi puts it in. One, two, three. He makes it quick and easy. Fantastic goal, really it was. Makes a slide through. Oh, he's got a man through a goal here. It's a stunning goal from Obi. What is going on everyone, my name is Ovi and it's time for my first team review in FIFA 15. We are going to talk about the best squad in the game and that is for sure Real Madrid. You might ask yourselves, why is Madrid the best team in game? Well, you're about to find out. We'll go with a variation of 4-5-1 and to be more exact, we'll be using the old 4-2-3-1 with 3 attacking mids, which is again the best formation in FIFA 15. Head to head, you have a strong defense with two defensive mids that are able to play box to box in order to support both the attack and the defense. Starting with the defense, in goal we have Casillas. He isn't as good as in the previous years. He got a serious downgrade from EA, but he is still the best goalkeeper from Real Madrid. In the center of the defense, we'll have a change comparing with last year's team. Varane will take the place of Pepe in defense. This year the Frenchman got a serious upgrade in speed and he is a rock in defense. He reminds me a lot of uh, Boateng, both being uh, big, strong and fast enough considering their height. Sergio Ramos is a must alongside Varane. He has the perfect combo of speed, strength and jumping, which allows him to be very good at defending counterattacks, crosses and positional attacks. As fullbacks, we have Marcelo and Carvajal, both very good at supporting the attack. They can provide nice crosses and also um, very, very effective deep passes for the wingers. In the middle, you have a variety of players to choose from. Toni Kroos, Modric, James Rodriguez and Kedira. These are the four from which you can pick your two starting defensive mids. I mostly went with uh, James Rodriguez and Toni Kroos because I loved the variety that they could offer to my game. They can defend as well as create chances in attack. If you don't feel comfortable in defense, you can go ahead and put Kedvira in. He will add that extra safety and close down spaces. But if you feel good defensively, then go ahead and give these two a chance. And make sure to use James Rodriguez as a right defensive mid and Tony Cross as a left defensive mid because you will want to abuse the overpowered finesse shot from outside the penalty area. In attack on the left Benzema will be very effective, he will be able to dribble his way into a crossing position or cut in using a step over and try a finesse shot. He has the finesse trait so make sure to give that a go. As a right attacking mid we have Jesse Rodriguez and even if he isn't so good at finishing he will be godly at creating chances for others. He is very agile, he has 4 star skill moves so don't be afraid of abusing those skill move combos. Gareth Bale will be the central attacking mid because he has that extra speed and stamina to be able to cover the area behind the striker. A player in that position has to be the playmaker and Bale possesses all the qualities needed in order to perform in this position. As a striker we have of course Cristiano Ronaldo and I want to make something clear. In real football this guy may be the perfect winger, but in FIFA stop making the mistake of using him there. He is fast, great at dribbling, amazing at finishing, again amazing at headers. You do not want to waste a player like this on the wing, you want him there in front scoring goals. As super sub, you have Chicharito Hernandez, who will help you a lot in the end of the games when stamina is running low on your players. Also, Modric, who is a very versatile player, is a very good option. So if you haven't started with him, then you must definitely sub him in, starting with the 60th minute. Regarding tactics with this team, it looks like in FIFA 15 it's okay to play balanced, but if in any moment of the game you feel vulnerable, just go defensive and put counter-attack. This will help you a lot in defense. I haven't uh, put out a video on custom tactics because I don't want to rush it and provide you with bad info. It's still early, I'll start um, to make my custom tactics series in about 2-3 weeks, so stay tuned for that. This was all regarding Real Madrid guys, I hope you enjoyed it, if you did leave a like and share the video, this helps everyone know where they can find the best team reviews. Thank you all for watching, don't forget to subscribe for more FIFA 15 content, my name is Ovi, see you later.